iPad OS 14. The first thing that you'll notice are the same redesigned widgets that you saw in iOS 14. And this year, we're making it even easier to browse and organize your photos with an all new sidebar. With just a tap of this button, I can reveal the sidebar with all the core functionality of the app in a single location. There's more, starting with Siri. Results appear at the bottom right corner, allowing you to easily reference the app while using Siri. Today, when you receive a call on iPad, you see this. Wouldn't it be nicer if instead you saw this? Well, that's much better. Now an incoming call is presented with a compact notification that doesn't take you out of context. And you can simply tap to answer or flick it away to dismiss. We've redesigned search with a new compact design. You can start a search from anywhere, like the home screen or over any app. We've rebuilt search from the ground up to be universal. You just start typing a few characters and you can instantly get to where you're going. I'm really excited to show you some of the great new features that we have for Apple Pencil and iPad OS this year. When I draw a simple shape and pause at the end, it'll automatically convert to that ideal shape. So we've also made huge improvements to our handwriting recognition. I can double tap to select a word or double tap again to select a line. I can easily change the color or move it around the document. Using Scribble, I can just write directly into the text field and it automatically gets converted to type text. It also works in any text field, so I can easily add a new reminder to my shared reminders list with my husband. 